Hi there. I've just rescued this model steam engine from my mother's and it was mine back in about 1970. So just to let you know, right from the get-go, this is not model railways. This is a steam traction engine review. So I just thought I'd give you that pre warning in case you're wondering what's going on. So this box is quite battered, but you can see from this little technical details the uh, workings and the parts of the model. And it is a working model, a steam uh, model run from methylated spirits. So let's have a look at the model. Looks like the drive belt's missing. So back in the day these would have been used on farms or fairgrounds to run carousels, that sort of thing. Just having a quick look at the other side. You've got the piston, whistle and so on. So what I need to do is go to the shop, get some uh, methylated spirits and we'll see if we can get it steamed up. Okay, got the fuel. Let's take the canopy off and the scuttle at the back, which is the, the black bit there. Canopy ju just unscrews with this little nut here. And it should just pop off. Okay, so the next thing we need to do is to fill the boiler full of water. And if what we do is we need to and remove that safety valve there, remove this plug and then top up the water there. So I'll do that now. So safety valve off, remove this plug and we'll put the water in there and I think when it gets to the top and starts coming out of the bat you've got it filled. Now the orange funnel there has gone missing so what I'm going to do is improvise and I'm going to use this syringe to try and put the water in at the top there. Need a bit more. Okay, it's now filled with water. Just put the safety valve back. Next is to fill this lamp or tray full of methylated spirits. Okay, now I'm about to light this methylated spirit. So just a word of warning for any youngsters about, make sure you've got an adult supervising this part of the process. Okay, it's lit. Now we can put it under the boiler. Right, it's on. So the boiler's been fired for about three or four minutes and it's still just getting up steam. Just whilst we're waiting, obviously you can have a better look at the model. You've got the, the flywheel, obviously the four wheels, the uh, forward and reverse, piston, uh, whistle, funnel obviously. Some nice little bit of engineering with the front wheels there with the spring loading. So it's, it's quite a nice little model. Please let me know if you've had one of these before. Right, they're starting to get some sounding, so I'll just see if the whistle works. See whether it'll run. Oh, I've just put the lid on, by the way, while I was waiting. See if we can give the flywheel a bit of help. I don't think it's quite enough steam yet. Well, we've got a lot of steam coming out of the safety valve, so it could be worn sealed, so I'm not sure this is going to run. It is virtually straightly out of the box, so let's just try. Oh, 
Oh, there we go. That's not bad, is it? See if I can stop it and put it in the other way. Try it the reverse. Oh, it wanted to go off its own back there. Just hang on. I think the problem here is the uh, safety valve seals have gone so there's not quite enough steam to generate power for it to run but you know it's quite an impressive little engine really isn't it okay I just thought I would show it to you um, as again drop some comments if you've had one before bye for now